Hi. Hi, how are you? I'm very good. How are you? Just very well, thank you. I am Karen. Yes. And where and are you from? The United States of America. Yes. Uh, my name is Tao, and I'm from Vietnam. Do you know Vietnam? Yes, I do. Of course. Yes. Have you ever been to Vietnam? Oh, no, no, no. I have not been there. I just know about Vietnam. Yes. So uh, uh, would you like to visit Vietnam one time? Um, I, I don't know. I don't know. I, I, I think I may, but it would be, it's, you know, for me, um, I don't have a problem flying, but, but my husband does. <laughs> <laughs> yes. And uh, I'm the beginner in Cambodian and also in English. <laughs> right now, I want to learn more about it. And uh, I want to improve my pronunciation <laughs> and listening skills. Uh, okay, okay. And so, do you want to be corrected after each mistake or only after like the serious mistakes or just wait till the end of the session? Uh, can you uh, can you repeat? I'm sorry. Okay. Um, do you want me to correct you after each mistake or just only after the serious mistakes? Uh, after the serious. Uh, serious. Okay. Yes. Okay. Okay. Good. And is this just for your professional? Um, is this for your job or is this just for personal self improvement? Uh, both. Um, oh, okay. <laughs> yes. And uh, can I ask you some questions? Certainly. What are your hobbies? What do you like to do on uh, your free time? Okay, so my hobbies are swimming. Yes. And I also like to play um, table tennis. Yes. And I like volleyball. Wow. <laughs> I know volleyball because uh, I have to learn it. In my gym class in school. Oh, okay, okay. Yes. So, so, what are your favorite hobbies? I like to cook. I like to read, and I like to play sports. Oh, okay, okay. So now, are you still at the university? Uh, no, uh, I'm in high school, and I will have to finish high school next year. Oh, okay, okay. Good deal. Good deal. So how long have you been um, practicing English? About four years. Okay. Well, you do very well. <laughs> Thank you. And do um, yeah. you like to read? Um, I do. I do. So what kinds of books do you like? Um, I like romance <laughs> novels. <laughs> wow. So what, what type you, uh, do you like? I like some uh, books about magic. Oh, wow, okay. Yes. I like Harry Potter. Ah, okay. Well, Harry Potter is, is, is a classic. Yes, and uh, could you suggest me some romance book that you like? Uh, this is a great author. I'm going to type it to you. Yes. Her name is Danielle Steele. Well, I think I yeah. can improve my reading skills when I read this book. Yeah, I think so, because it's not too difficult to read, but it's not too simple. So it's just right in between there where where the words aren't too um too large or, or, you know, there's not a lot of complicated words. Um, her novels are really good. Yes. Yeah, so uh, have you ever read uh, Harry Potter? Um, you know, I started it, but honestly, it's too, it's too much for me. It's too, too much reading. <laughs> it's okay. Um, and uh, do you like uh, watching film? No, uh, um, I do. No. Uh, yes, I do. Yes, a uh, romance film after you read books. Um, yeah, I, now, if, if I'm going to watch something, I like to watch something that's more um, action. Oh, wow. You like action. 
Yeah, yeah. I because if it moves too slow, if I'm watching it, I you know they'd lose me because like a, a movie or a show that just moves slow before they get to the you know real um, the the actual meaning of the show. Yes, and uh, the, what do you think of horror films? I don't like horror films. They are so fake. Uh, I just those those they call them slasher movies um, in America, and I just don't like them. I think they're they're too predictable. I don't like now. Now that's too predictable. Um, I don't mind watching a thriller, but it has to be a psychological thriller. Yes. Uh, about what about yeah. you? I like horror film because uh, I usually watch horror film with my friends on the weekend. Oh, okay, okay, yeah. I'm, now that would—I mean, I guess if you're younger and you want to watch horror films, yeah, that would be cool. Yeah. Yes, and uh, uh, do do you have a do you have a pet in your house? I uh, do you live in a house. Yes, I yes, yes. Uh, do you have any pets in your house? Um, yes, one a dog. <laughs> wow, dog is very lovely. Yes, I love dogs. Yes, uh, I'm, too. I'm not so fond of cats, but I do love dogs. Me too. I love dogs too. Uh, and I have five dogs. Did you say five? Yes. That's a lot of dogs. <laughs> yes, because uh, I live in the countryside, so uh, um, I have very large garden. So I have five dogs. Wow, are all of them the same breed, or are all of are all of? Can you repeat? Okay, are all of your dogs the same breed? Yes. Oh my gosh, what 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 breed are they? <laughs> uh, you mean uh, you mean uh, boy or uh, what 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 type of dog? Uh, I'm sorry, but uh, I don't know the type of my dog because I think. Oh. Yes, I think uh, there there are no kind, no no type. Okay, okay. So they're not a um, Shih Tzu or a Labradoodle or no. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Are they big or small? I have two big and three small. Do they all get along? Yes. Oh, okay. Okay. How old are they? Uh, two, my two big dogs uh, is two years old. Oh, okay. okay. Yeah. And uh, my three small is puppies. Very. Right? Uh, they are babies. Oh. Oh, I bet they're so cute. Yes. Very cute. Oh. Oh, that's a lot. It's a lot of dogs, though. Yes, but uh, I live in a big house. Yes, yes, I live in a big house because, uh, because I live in the countryside, and my mom and my dad are farmers. Oh, okay, okay. Well, yeah, yeah. Then, then that's okay to have that many dogs because they have a lot of. If your mom and dad are farmers, they have a lot of land. Yes. Good gracious. That, yeah. That I. I don't. You know, it's been a long time since I heard someone say they have five dogs. But I do understand why, because on a farm, you you need a lot of dogs. Yes. And uh, what is your? How many seasons are there in your country? In the US? four. Four. We have summer, spring. We have well, let's see. We have spring, summer, fall, and winter. Yes, uh, very uh, like Vietnam. We also have four seasons. And what is your favorite season? Um, summer. Oh, me too. I also like summer. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I like the summer because you can do a lot of 
outdoor things and um but yet you know you can come in and and do things on the inside if it gets too hot so but i just like the outdoors yes uh, i also like summer because i like the hot weather and ah. and um I, i like to swim so i like hot weather oh okay okay so yeah. so your your parents farm what do they raise what do they have on their farm uh we uh, uh my father grows some um, plants like uh, oranges and some oh. yes and some fruits to sell in the market hmm. okay yes and my mother keeps some animal like chicken and pig Oh, okay. Yeah. So do you like growing up on a farm? Yes, of course. Okay. I, I grow some flowers in my farm. Oh, that's so sweet. <laughs> yes, I grow some roses and chrysanthemum. Oh, I love roses. Yeah. Uh, so what is the, the color roses uh, do you like? Oh, I think I like red. Wow. That's that really deep red. Yes. yes. Cuz it's so pretty. Yes. And they smell so good. Yes. Um I also like red roses and I grow some red and white roses. Wow. Huh. Are they hard to grow? Uh, I think not uh not hot. <laughs> Oh okay. Huh. Cuz I guess I never realized that, you know. Yes. Wow, that's fun. Huh. And do you uh, sell your roses? Uh and you live in a house so uh, do you have uh, any uh, garden? Um no, I am not much on the gardening side. Um I actually do want a garden, but I, I think I'm I think you have to put in too much work for a garden. <laughs> yeah, so uh do you, um if you don't have a garden, so do you grow some small small plant? Um well, we do have um rose well little small rose bushes and then tulips yes and um uh, do you have a brother or sister oh yes 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 i have um um one brother and three sisters um, they're all older <laughs> yes and uh, what did they do uh, did they uh, teach on family like you Um actually no. Um uh, my brother is a plumber. Um uh, uh, my sister is um she's an office manager and then I have another one that works in um like city government wow. and then another one that works at a um what do you call that a um pharmaceutical company. Wow. Very great. Yeah. And uh yeah. I also have one brother and he is older than me. And uh oh. yeah, and he is a manager for a company. Oh, okay. Okay. So we got a lot in common, huh? Yeah. So your brother's a manager. Okay. And you are the baby just like me. I'm the baby. Yes. And uh Okay. Do you live with your brother and sister or do you live alone? No, no, no. I'm married. I live with my husband. Yes. Yes. And I, and I have five children. Wow. You have five children. Wow, very great. Wow. Yeah. Yeah, I have two boys and three girls, but they're yeah. my my children are all grown. Well, uh I think they are very cute, very lovely. Uh yeah, yeah, when they were growing up, yes. Yes. But um you know, since they're all grown now, it's just myself and my husband in the house, so It's a big house with only two people in it. <laughs> yes. Uh, I so do you, do you know the book that I because I want to learn a little about grammar of English. So but I don't know how to, but I don't know how to uh, learn begin how to start. So can you can you help me? Yes. Okay. So first of all, um I'm going to say that you you speak pretty pretty well. Thank you. you really do. Um 
and your your conversation is very interesting. Um, so if you want to improve upon the grammar portion of your um, speech, then I would suggest um, that you do you do a lot of writing? Yes, uh, I do. Okay, so when you write, do you have your um, how do you how do you know that your grammar is correct? Who's checking that? Yes. Uh I use I use to learn grammar, but uh, I think it's very difficult. So I, I <laughs> give up for a long time. Okay, so what can happen is it, it, we can divide things up. Um, whereas you might learn, I think probably the hardest thing to me for students to learn are um, tenses. Yeah. <laughs> I think uh, tense is, is very difficult to understand. Well, I think I think that's because in most of the other countries, um, the tenses they're not even very similar. And and uh, when when the lang when other languages are spoken, they really there's not a tense situation. Yes. You know. So I think that's why it's so difficult. Um, other than that, I, I think that's probably where you would need to start is on the census. But we have um, like lessons where we go over, um, you know, past, present, future, simple, that type of thing. And, and it's a whole 30 minutes devoted to the subject so that you understand the subject. And then you have the opportunity to ask questions the way I do. I teach a little section and then I go back. And even if the student says, OK, I understand, I go back and say, OK, well, let's make sure let's use this in a sentence or um, that type of thing, because I always make sure that before I move on, because it doesn't make sense to keep moving on if the student doesn't understand. Um, I I used to learn gra grammar in a Vietnamese book, but I don't understand. And in my <laughs> and in my school, uh, we don't have the foreigner teacher. Uh, we just oh. yes, we just have a Vietnamese teacher, so I can't understand. Okay, okay. Well, yeah, and I and I do understand that. So that's why you probably need to start off taking um, on the simple stuff, you know, the nouns, verbs, adverbs, adjectives, yeah. and that type of thing, and then move on up to the tenses, because I, I do, I think that's the most difficult thing for yeah. students to learn. Yes. Because there's so many rules to the tenses. Yes. Yeah. So uh, do you have a book that I can learn grammar now? Um, I Okay, so I actually, on Cambly, they have what they call a library. So our students can pick out, now we, we can pick out the lesson, but if we're told ahead of time what they really want to, you know, focus on, but Cambly has a library which is open to all students. You open up the library and you pick out what subject you want to work on yeah. for that particular lesson. So you can find that and then you just send me the link and then I just go there with the link and then we work the lesson together. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. Cause, I mean, so I, I would encourage you to open up the library. I don't know if, if you're going to continue with Cambly, but if you continue with Cambly, then yeah. you would open up your library to, um, you know, focus on a particular subject. And, and again, yes, the tenses are hard. And it has many, many lessons on tenses. Yes. Um, so I, I would encourage you to do that. Yes. Oh, our yeah. time yeah. is running out, you see? Yes. Yes, it is. I enjoyed speaking with you. Me too. I'm really happy to talk with you. Me too. So hopefully we can talk again sometime. Yes, I hope so. And okay. So have a nice day. Goodbye. Okay, you too. Goodbye. Goodbye.